And the big news um, during, I guess, my first semester of sophomore year was um, was the 96 national election. And uh, in fact, one thing I remember is that my roommate and I, uh, Jason Chipman, we had a, um, a Clinton Gore sign that we placed on the door of our dorm room in Marshall. And uh, it really is a very basic elemental form of political expression, not out of the ordinary anyway. And at some point during the semester, someone tore it down. And I was angry, but Jason was furious. And he went out in the hall and he basically and he said in a very loud voice for a couple of minutes, something to the effect of that it's a shame that you know, people can't express their simple First Amendment political views and that someone came and tore down our political sign and kind of went on a justified tirade about it for uh, a little bit. But that, was, that, that election was a big deal. I mean, we'd suffered through three Republican regimes at that point, and uh, having Clinton elected was uh, a bit of a lifeline for a lot of people, uh, regardless of what people thought of his subsequent performance, uh, politically or personally. Um, that was a, a big watershed moment for us uh, politically. Um, socially, I thought the sort of moment, national moment that stuck out in my mind the most from my college time was probably the Oklahoma City bombing, which would have been April 95, which is shortly before I graduated from Aaron Washington. And that was really one of those um, sort of national collective consciousness type moments where everyone is focused on one issue, which really hadn't been true for much of those two, three years before. I mean, there's always scandals, political or otherwise, and um, you know, various domestic and foreign policy issues, but that was really um, sort of a, a watershed moment that everyone was talking about uh, on a national level. 